Wait. Yes, I'm talking to you. Let me explain all the nutrients that are in that cheeseburger. Okay. That cheeseburger contains polymers, which are large molecules made up of smaller molecules called monomers. Think of this train car as a monomer. We can link monomers, even different kinds, together to form a long molecule. In this case, the train, which is a polymer. There are three polymers needed by the body, which are carbohydrates, lipids, and proteins. The first polymer, carbohydrates, are made of small molecules called monosaccharides, which are simple sugars, such as glucose and fructose. These monosaccharides can be linked together to form polymers, such as sucrose or table sugar. Since only two are linked, it is called a disaccharide. Many monosaccharides can be put together, such as chains of glucoses forming starch found in plants. Since many were put together, it is called a polysaccharide. There are other polysaccharides. When glucoses are branched like this, it is called glycogen, which the body stores in the liver. Other glucose chains form cellulose in plants, also known as fiber, which humans cannot digest. Fiber is important to eat because it helps food move through the digestive system and can lower your cholesterol. The main function of all these carbohydrates is to provide the body with energy and to help make some cell parts too. The second polymer, lipids, also is used for energy, but in the long term. Lipids are made using fatty acids. If a fatty acid has all the hydrogens it can possibly fit, it is called saturated. These are solid fats like butter, which can raise your cholesterol. If the fatty acid has a double bond, it is called unsaturated. These are liquid fats like oil, and can even lower your cholesterol. When three fatty acids are linked to a glycerol molecule, it forms a triglyceride, the fat used for energy. If you eat too many of these, the body stores it as body fat, making you bigger around the middle. Two fatty acids added to a phosphate group form phospholipids that join together to make your cell membranes. Another lipid is cholesterol, naturally made by your liver. It is involved with cell membranes in making hormones like testosterone and estrogen. Too much, however, has negative health effects. The last polymer, proteins, build body structures like muscle and cell membranes and act as enzymes to speed up chemical reactions. Proteins are made from combinations of 20 amino acids, which all differ based on this side chain. The amino acids can be linked together using a peptide bond. Many amino acids linked together is called a polypeptide, which can be folded and added to other polypeptides to form complex proteins like hemoglobin, which carries oxygen in your blood. Proteins speed up reactions by acting as enzymes, which can help break molecules or help build them as seen here. That cheeseburger is filled with carbohydrates, proteins, and lipids. Chemical reactions during digestion break them apart into monosaccharides, fatty acids, and amino acids, which can be used by the body to build the carbohydrates, lipids, and proteins that it needs to function. The chemical reactions used to break the molecules, plus the ones used to build them, are collectively called your metabolism. Something to think about as you eat that burger. Thanks.